yes let's make sure you click oh oh yes and then you oh, yes okay let's resume hi guys d sims here and welcome back to the channel and today i bring to you our journey hey hey change your plans you got a fam and making bands hey. and we're back with another episode and i'm really excited about this little episode i got a cute little plan let's hope things stay that way okay <laughs> Um, today is, um, Aspen's first day of official school. Ooh, journey, girl. We gotta get, we gotta get them little mammoths things together. Um, so I just have her coming in here to wake up Aspen because it is her first day of school. I'm not gonna lie. I went ahead and cheated up a couple of milestones for Denver so he can like sit in a high chair because I kind of got a cute little idea. So right now he's just doing some tummy time. I don't think he's happy that he's awake. Oh, cause he's crying. Okay, yeah, your father could come in there. Um, yeah, let's let's probably have him come in here and just maybe I don't know. Oh, you know, tell him bedtime story, soothe him back to sleep. You know, it's a little early, but yes, we're gonna get Aspen up cause she needs to get ready for school. Good morning. Let's give her a, a nice little hug because today is her first day of school. Also, I figured out why I couldn't have her join an after school activity. So we're gonna do that first. Oh, let's do like a little family kiss. Yeah. Oh, she gotta use the bathroom. I know. Okay, I know. Journey, journey, journey. Okay, please don't take all day, y'all. The girl gotta use the bathroom. Yes, let's just give her a little good morning. I hope you have a good day at school. Yes, a perfect. Okay. Um. I need, at, uh, not Aspen, I need Journey to just probably make something really quick for breakfast. Um, oh no, you know, it's the first day. We should make something, we should make something delicious. Okay, maybe some honey banana toast. Okay, let's do that. Okay, I'm gonna have Journey go and do that. Okay, we're going to the bathroom. Let's go ahead and get ready. That's her first little uh, day in school. Oh, do she have enough time to play in the bath? Probably not. Maybe we'll just do a little bit of a quick bath and we will brush our teeth. Make sure this is set to bathroom. Okay, yes, it is. And I kind of want her to plan a little outfit. Like maybe she's like picking out her clothes or something like that. So I think we're gonna try to do that. So we're gonna have her get ready for school and it's gonna be super cute and all that good stuff so the baby is back to sleep which is great journey does have work which kind of suck wait journey did you make the so there's nobody listening again back to the not listening you know what ace like look I, I i'll do breakfast can y'all just pull out some cereal like it's really not that hard like come on y'all i mean goodness i just wanted something to go right oh it is dirty down here journey you got the vacuum okay you do let's have you just come over here and sweep you need to sweep things up since you want to eat and not worry about stuff okay ace just pulled out some cereal so perfect we can just grab some cereal and stuff she's taking her a little bath which is great and it's six o'clock so yeah more than enough time more than enough time before i forget i want to just cue it up i really want her to join an after school activity so um i want her to do girl scouts oh she can't do okay okay great i want you to do a girl scout can you do that like can you remember so i don't forget but we're gonna find her a cute little um a cute little outfit and just go from there see how things go Something like this is so freaking cute. So she got on literally like every single accessory she owns. And I thought it would be cute if like Journey did her hair and these cute little plaits. Y'all, my little baby, her first day of school. Okay, now that we picked out her outfit, she can go ahead and change into her new little look, which is great. And yes, we're going to get her together. 
So I want her to join the scouts. Now, as you can see, there's a lot of different things we can join. But for right now, we're gonna try the scouts. I think it's a cute, I think it's cute. It'll be a cute little idea. Um, and we'll make it work. So we entered the scouts and it's now on Saturday at 2 p.m. I do have a mod in that makes it less frequent, but now that I think about it, I think I want her to go to scouts more often. So I may change that. Okay, I went ahead and changed the scouting thing. So now she'll have scouts on Saturday and Sunday and we can work on stuff in between, which is good. So she's gonna eat her cereal and I think we're going to be in a good little spot. Um, let's have him go ahead and grab some cereal as well. And maybe they could talk this morning. Checking on Aspen, that's okay. And, um, bright end day. Oh, just an update. I went ahead and, uh, removed the healthcare redo out of my game. Just because, y'all, it was just doing too much. Like, I love the mod, but it was too frequent. I guess that's the point of it. I guess I just need a little break from it. Maybe we'll put it back in another day. But for right now, yeah. Mm-mm. I'm okay. Oh my gosh, Journey, why are you throwing up? Y'all, she literally just threw up. Journey, why did you just throw up on the floor? Oh my God, Journey, please. Oh, the sillier the better. Ace like silly behavior, of course. Okay, so I did have them wrestle because, you know, I just be playing them off time. Not playing them all time playing when it's like trying to start the new day and they both needed fun and we both know how to do some fun up in the game you better not be you better not because why were you throwing up no way y'all There is no way, y'all. Bro. Y'all. Okay. Whew. Okay, so last episode, I ended the part at like midnight or something like that. So the baby was downstairs in the kitchen. You could go back and check this because I'm telling y'all exactly what I did. The baby was down here in the kitchen. And I think Ace had just got out the shower or something. He was sitting on the couch. So I loaded back the save and I'm like, okay, I'm going to play to the morning. Like I always do. I always do stuff in the morning. Like if they need to do job stuff, whatever, prep for the episode to start, whatever. So I made Journey put the baby in the bed. Her fun or his, one of their funds were low. And I'm like, okay, you know, I clicked here and I clicked woohoo with ace there was a try for baby and there was a self woohoo but i made sure i click woohoo with ace you know what i think just happened there's a new update of rvo <laughs> where your sims can get pregnant it's, you know just risky woohoo or whatever but i think the throwing up thing where she just like threw up on the floor that's the new thing where you don't know you're pregnant until the second trimester but i knew the throwing up the throwing up is the sign there's no way she's pregnant. We just said in the last episode, we are done having kids. I was going to get the, the I, didn't I get her the IUD and everything? Girl, there's no way she's pregnant. Yeah, she's pregnant. Yeah. Oh my God. We were about to go on vacation. I mean, she could still go on vacation while she's pregnant, but it was supposed to be like, oh, our kids are growing up. We can enjoy family time now. Oh my God. I swear to not playing this, y'all. I did not want no more kids. I'm ha I have enough kids between this and Barbie. I have have I have enough. I cannot believe she's pregnant. Okay, well, whatever. <gasps> I guess I'm happy, but I didn't want another baby right now. And why is she already so ser like seriously bumping? Bye, the baby not in the bathroom. What you doing? Now she making her leave. The baby. Okay, you know what? It's fine. When do you go to school? You go to school now. Why didn't you go to school? Okay, well, she goes to school now. Let, let's let just have her go go head off to school. We love you. Oh, wait, we need to take like a first day of school picture, like in front of the house or something. Um, Can you just like go here? And who has the camera? Does dad have the camera? 
Okay, I think dad has the camera. Let's just take one on his phone. Take a photo. I cannot believe Journey is pregnant. I wasn't trying to do that. Take a photo of Aspen. This is insane, y'all. This is not what I wanted. I promise you, I am so done with having kids. Like, I wasn't having no more kids in none of my none of my series for a minute. I wonder what Ace is gonna say. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Okay, happy first day of school, my love. Okay, um, give me another pose. Oh, this is so cute. Look at her first day of school. Her her. Oh. First day of school, my little baby. She's so cute. She's like the best thing ever. <gasps> A child. And there's gonna be another one. <gasps> when will we know peace? Okay, go to school, little baby. Have a good day at school. Daddy loves you. All that good stuff. <gasps> Period. Oh, the baby learned how to creep. Oh, oh okay, wow, great. Creep. Okay, now that, yeah. now that the baby learned how to creep. Oh. Journey, you know, you might want to go to work. No, don't go to work. I lied. First, you need to tell Ace that you're pregnant. Because should she not tell him? I mean, girl, how could she not? She could just say she had Chipotle. Girl, she looked pregnant. She looked so pregnant. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, leap into arms. He can be like, whoa, got some Chipotle? I'm just kidding. He won't say that. Oh, no. Journey has been feeling late. Boy, very active to lazy. Journey's been spending time either missing work or being lazy around the house. No, she missing work because I got her doing stuff. Get off her neck. Okay, I want her to um make friends. Yeah, she's like, oh, you have some Chipotle, babe? No, I'm just kidding. Don't say that. Okay, girl, you just gotta tell him. You gotta tell him that you're pregnant. Like, what? Why is she so bad? Remember at the beginning of this, I was like, oh, I just hope this episode goes as planned. Announce news pregnancy. Girl, just go ahead and do it. Let's see what he's saying. Ace, please tell me you're happy. Don't be mad. I don't understand if you're upset. I'm upset. Okay, and he looks happy. Did you just tell him? Did, did, does Ace know? Oh, Addition to the family. Yes, he's happy. Okay, girl, go to work. I need a break. Go to work. I'm so mad. Journey been getting on my nerves for so long. <sighs> anyway, um, let's go ahead and spend some time with the baby because today is Denver's birthday. So he's going to be aging up. But I already told y'all, we're not doing a whole bunch of, um, we're not doing a whole bunch of birthday parties. Um, I did have a plan tonight to go like, to a little dinner and then maybe we could bring like a little cake out and he can age up at dinner. I thought that would be super cute. Um, Still might do that, but that means Ace will have to take off. Well, he could work from home again, even though he never does his task from home. I'm just not worried about it because I just, I just don't care about his job like that. Like he used to care, but I never did. Um, So I just don't, especially because all the work home assignments is always like he has to go to the strangerville and girl we don't have time for that we're not going to strangerville how's this baby feeling he needs a bottle okay let's go ahead and give him a bottle but yeah i don't particularly like when things like work from home assignments are like out of the way like if it's gonna be work from home i need to be able to do it from the house you know like click on here and be like write a case file or watch military channel i don't know you know when it's not out the way um maybe they can come down here and do something really cute i cannot believe she's pregnant like literally what but look look at my baby he can creep he's taking a little bottle oh let's go ahead and get your little um diaper together and then he should be in a better mood and they can kind of hang out and do some stuff I cannot believe she's pregnant again. I cannot believe she's pregnant again. I am so hurt. I was done. I was done. Just nothing else that needed to happen. Anyway, Ace is such a good dad. 
Oh gosh. Add another one to the bunch, Ace. Just add another one to the bunch. Someone's calling. What's up, Chuck? Aspen got sick and threw up in the hallway in front of a bunch of other students. Not on her first day. She's with the nurse now. Do a thorough health check, please. On her first day, my baby. Oh no, she got sick. Okay, just, just do some normal stuff. Just participate in group work or something. Oh, my little baby, should we bring her home early? You wanna come home more early? Hey, so let's do a little bit of, I guess some tummy time or just playing small talk. Um, blow raspberries, that's so cute. The infants, they just shock me still to this day. Infants still shock me, pets still shock me in seasons. Why? I don't know, y'all. I don't know. So we're gonna practice some crawling as well. Again, it is his birthday, so we're gonna just do everything we can. Hopefully he had a good little infant life. Oh, he should get a promotion. Why do babies be sound like they struggling? It's okay. It's okay. Okay, right now we're just practicing some crawling. He's struggling a little bit, but we're practicing. Aspen's getting up her creativity skill, which is adorable. I cannot believe this one is pregnant, bro. Future parents united. I cannot believe she is pregnant. Why? I'm so sorry, y'all. I'm so sorry. <laughs> My game be gaming a little too much, too realistic. I mean, I know her and Ace be wrestling all the time, but they grown, they can wrestle. Maybe I should have got some shower curtains, but she on the BC. Okay, I'm thinking of something Ace could do since um, Aspen's having like a little rough day at school. I'm thinking we could do something that'll kind of cheer her up a little bit. And one thing I've been wanting to do is get a lemonade stand. Y'all know that's the whole reason we planted all this stuff here is because I really want Aspen to run a cute little lemonade stand in front of the house. So maybe we can do that. And then eventually all when Denver grows up, they can run it together. It'll be adorable. Okay. Something like this. I think this is going to be so cute. And let's have him make a glass of lemonade. And I think I'm pretty sure that Aspen can use this and make it. So if not, I have another method of how we can make a lemonade stand. But I think right now, this is one by Ice Mun Mun, and I think she'll be able to use it. But it does kind of function as a bar, so it's a little iffy. But we have other options. Look at his little lemonade, it's so cute. So Aspen should be home at three o'clock and then we can test all this out. Okay, Journey's home. Aspen wants to invite over her classmate, Sean. Okay, invite over Sean. Her grades are up. She's already a B student. Come on, my baby going to Ivy League. Okay, this is her friend, Sean. Hey, Sean. She like, wait, is this lemonade stand for me? I hope it is. Ask to mix a drink. Okay, yeah, let's go to plan B. Okay, plan 1A is this. So still using Ice Mun Mun's mod, the, lemon, the lemonade mod, um, there is another cart that you can use that you can sell from it, but you have to provide the lemonade. So this is the picture that you can use to make the lemonade. So we're just gonna find something really cute and do like a little cute setup where she can make lemonade and sell it. And I think that'll be so cute. Okay, I think I found something that I like and here it is. So she should be able to use this huge pitcher to make some lemonade. And then I think she'll be able to like put it in here and sell it. And I think that'll be so cute. Look, her little friend's coming over. Hey, you want some lemonade? Right, you want some lemonade? I'll grab a drink. Okay, so she can grab one. Oh, okay, she, she kind of jump up there a little bit. That's fine. Dang, all of that lemonade went in that cup. Wait, you're not gonna talk to your friend. <laughs> Become friends with Sean. Okay, Sean, hello. Um, We're gonna call him over. You gotta see the new lemonade stand. Oh, they in here watching Brow Family. Okay, well, come on in. I mean, I made the lemonade stand. You know what? Let me exit out of this really quick. I'm gonna have her stop drinking and lemonade to see if I can put it in this stand. This is all troubleshooting because this has been a big vision of ours. We wanted this lemonade stand for a minute. 
So I'm putting her inventory. She got her big old glass of lemonade. And then if I put this in there, yes, this works. So how many days? It says six days, which is great. And then she should be able to stock the table. Actually, let me put her and her friend in a group. Where do you go? Um, LaShawn. I'm not going to hold you, y'all. I think Sean is one of our residents. I think that's one of our residents from one of uh, our little apartments. So I'm going to have them form. Oh, my bad. I'm going to have them form a group. Um, add to group. There we go. And then they both can come out here really fast. Walk here together. I just want to see if she can stock the table and if all of this will work. I'm pretty sure it will. Y'all need to stop all of this. That's why we got another baby on the way now. I am so shook about this baby. Like this is crazy. Say hi to the baby. Just go on here. Okay. And speaking of stuff being wrong now we got an electrical failure okay so can we tend the table now yes can we tend it we can mark up the prices i mean we're not looking for anything crazy that's a little lemonade stand and then we can start a yard sale that's so cute so cute okay enthused about candy okay who's who's calling you did you hear they're turning book block into a movie how would that ever be good girl i don't know but hey um aspen has some other friends as well that grew up with her which is kiana i believe and ebony right let's invite them over because those are her friends as well and i think this will be really cute invite her little friends over and then maybe they can come and do some gardening you know they can weed together like oh man we're gonna make so much money from our little we're gonna make so much money from our um, lemonade stand. This is great. He's like, yeah, come on over. I got a new lemonade stand. Oh, you know what we need to do while the, the little kids are over here? We need to go ahead and bake Denver a cake. So Denver can be a part of the little baby shenanigans as well. I mean, not as much, cause he'll be a toddler, but you know, we still include our little baby. I think we're gonna go ahead and make this plum bob cake. That's cute. So we'll make that. The baby is awake, but because he knows how to sit up and stuff, he'll start like moving around in here a lot. But you know, it's still cute. Maybe they can come over here and have some fun. Maybe do some more tummy time or whatever. Um, uh, do some little affections, activities, and comfort. Yeah, look, he just moving all around. Your dad's coming, don't worry. Oh, we got a dirty bottle on the floor. If you don't come and get this baby, is he trying to go to sleep? Okay, no, not tummy time. Dad is coming. Um, Comfort him. Yes, come get him. Hey, are your little friends here yet? Did they show up? Oh, they are here. We need to give everybody little cute makeovers. So here's Kiana. And we're going to just invite her, add her to the group. And I don't know where Ebony is. Let me double check where she is. Did you show up yet, Ebony? Focus the camera. Oh yes, Ebony is here, okay. So this is cute. Let's go ahead and add them to the group. And then everybody can come over here. Here, let's, let's come over here and weed together. Okay, I want all the kids to come in the little lemonade garden. They're about to make money. Like, we're gonna do this together. Come on. Here, let's um uh, weed together with all the group. We need to do any watering. Can they water together? Where's where's all the kids? Come on, kiddos. Come on, we gotta work on our lemonade empire. Hey, dad, maybe, you know, dad would do the pesticide things. Let's go ahead and um, spray for bugs because you know, the kids can't do all of that. And it looks like we got some dead plants, but this is actually a glitch, but we're just gonna get rid of them for right now. But everybody can come over here and weed the little plants. Can everybody not weed? I don't know, maybe they can't. I do know you have to be a certain skill. But look, she's doing great. You know what? This all may work towards her, her badges as well. We need to put up her little 
um, badge. I think I do have a version of this that goes on the wall. There's a, a version we can just put somewhere. Um, let's see about getting one of those too. Yes, here we go. So there's one that you can just interact with by putting it on the wall. So I think this will be cute maybe to have downstairs in the playroom. And we can just check her progress whenever we want to. I'm just gonna put it like really low to the ground. We can check, I don't know where the baby went. I'm sorry, Denver. Did you start on that cake, Miss Girl? Finish the cake. Finish the cake. The baby needs a cake. So yeah, she should be able to come over here and view her progress and all that good stuff. Look, she's talking to her little friends. Um, and I'm gonna have him come in. Oh, is he getting rid of that plant? Yeah, we're getting rid of the, the other plant. And then she can harvest this stuff, right? Oh, she doesn't have enough mental skill for that. Oh, okay. Well, we'll wait until she can until she can harvest it. But this is nice. This is great. I want to check on her little progress. See all the things she needs to do. And this will be cute. Oh, let's put this in the sink. Check on your progress. How are we doing? Okay. So her sociability, two out of 12. So there's a whole bunch of things. I love this because... It's just more in depth than all the other um, after school activities. So yes, we need to do good deeds and all of these will give us a badge. So the, the easiest ones or the ones that don't require that much is giving back. Um, to earn this badge, donate items for charity from the mailbox and computer or perform friendly socials and give gifts to people. So we should make some things that we can give to her friends. Also scholarly aptitude. Perform studious activities like reading books or completing homework. Ooh, speaking of that, that's really good. Um, let's buy us uh, some homework books because we actually I can work. So we'll just buy a little grade school homework, which is great. And I think if we open this, we should have one in here. And we can do some little homework together. So if I have everybody come and sit together, which will be good. Oh, she actually needs to tinkle first. My bad. Let's have her tinkle. Use the bathroom. Oh, and then there's a the cake. Okay, perfect. Please don't eat it. Journey, can we put some candles in this cake? Add some birthday candles. Add some candles. There we go. Okay. She's going to the bathroom and then we'll have the whole, the whole little group come over and we'll do homework together. They can go over PE notes. They can learn about sharing is caring, do math problems. I feel like I would be working with vocabulary together because I just feel like, girl, vocabulary, you need a you need a whole team. Cause don't have them try to make me spell restaurant unnecessary. Girl, it's over. Over. But look at her little friends. We have to give them makeovers. I wanna do that now. I wanna I think I'm gonna give everybody makeovers really soon. Why aren't you saluting to the child, Ace? Please. Okay, let's speed this up a little bit because I want her to get in here. Oh, wait, why is there water on the floor? Journey, come mop this up. Now that Journey's pregnant, y'all, she's going to be so tired all the time. Where are they all going to do homework? Oh, are they like going up to her room? Oh, that's kind of cute. Okay, y'all can go ahead up there. It's getting a little late. We do need to get the baby a... Uh, his birthday. I don't want him to age up without having the little birthday thing. That would make me really sad. But I kind of want them to do their homework. Oh no, everybody's about to start leaving. No, everyone do your homework. Oh, I didn't know they could do homework at this little table. Wait, can they? Why is no one else doing homework? Why is she the only person doing homework? Okay, I don't want anyone else to leave. So you know what? We're about to just Journey, get up. Dang. So mad that she's pregnant. <laughs> so mad. Um, now let's just have everybody go here. Yeah, let's just do that. I can have her do her homework with her friends later. Okay, Ace, let's go ahead and wake up this baby. Yes, wake him up. And we're all gonna be here to celebrate his birthday. It's not as special and big and everything. 
It's Aspen's, no particular reason, only because I just can't do more parties. I just can't at this point. Okay, so did you pick him up? Pick up, yes. And then we're going to help blow out the candles. Baby Denver, it's his birthday. Let's do it. I cannot believe she's pregnant. I know I keep saying that. I'm so in shock, bro. But here we go. All right. Happy birthday, my little baby. Look, look at my picture. Let's go. Okay, so he was wiggly. Um, Denver has earned a bonus trait. Okay, he got top-notch infant. We love to see it. Seven, here we come. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have mute. They're unable to speak and independent. All right, let's go with it. Okay, oh, my baby got bundles. Come on, Denver. Okay, we need to give everybody their little makeovers. I'm going to be in cash for quite a while. But let's get to it, y'all. Let's do this. Look at baby Denver. He's so cute. I love his little outfit, his little skater shoes. He's so adorable. Okay, so I got his outfit done. I decided I'm going to do the friends another time. But for right now, let's all get cake. Do we all want to get some cake? Uh, Call to the meal and eat. Where is that at? Call to the meal and eat. Aspen, Denver, Ebony, and Kiana. You guys can go and eat some good old stuff. Um, the best void critter. I got in a fight with someone at school about which void critter is more powerful. Both are equally powerful. We don't know. You know how you be asking parents stuff, baby? They don't know. They have no idea. Okay, everybody come get some cake. Nice. Everybody come do. Okay, not you. You don't get any cake. Oh my goodness, morning sickness. She wants some healthy food. Her back is sore. Okay, well, if you want healthy food, this is not what you want. Let's find you some things that, that would help you with your healthy food. Anything, look, salad. Stop eating cake. Get the salad. You know, you can go to the bathroom, all that good stuff. Everybody else is eating cake. This is cute. Oh, we're really tired, but we also need to do our homework. So we'll go back to doing our vocabulary together after this. Denver, do you have some cake? Why are you all the way out there? You know what? Dad will come and get some cake with you. But does dad want cake? I don't know. I don't think dad wants cake. We're gonna get the adults to eat something else other than sugar. Um, Let's have dad get a quesadilla. We have so much food in here. Oh, of car, course, he's a messy eater. Okay, baby, it's okay. You just go ahead and enjoy your cake. And you come out here and you can steady sit here and watch some TV or something, which would be great. Okay, all the friends have to get going. It is late, I understand if you have to leave. Okay, that's enough cake. Let's go ahead and start doing our homework together though. Cause I would love for them to at least do a little bit of homework. Well, look like Kiana's staying, that's okay. Hey girl, stay over. Oh yeah, I forgot she got her void critter. Oh, she leaving too. She's like, girl, it's 10 o'clock. I'm gonna get in trouble. My curfew at 11. Okay, bye Kiana. Thank you for being here. Oh, I can't believe, why is he outside, Lord? Oh, you know what? Before you go to bed, let's potty train. Potty train Denver. Oh, we also need to get him a big boy bed because he is no longer a little baby. So let's. Auto lights this whole room. Oh goodness. Oh, yes, strict. I, I can see Journey being strict. You got to with these kids. If not, they are gonna end up like Barbie twins. <laughs> Be strict with them, Journey, please. Okay, my baby's over here just doing all of her little homework. Her outfit is so stinking cute. We need to work on her mental skills so she can continue working on the garden so she can make more lemonade. But I think this is gonna be so good. Okay, once you're done your homework, you can go ahead and go to sleep for the night. Denver's getting potty trained, which is nice. I cannot believe sis is pregnant. Like, I'll y'all could count how many times I said it. I cannot believe I even witnessed half of the stuff I witnessed. This is insane. Yes. Okay, so welcome to your little bathroom. This is the bathroom you and your sister share. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, I can have her come over here and check her baby bump. That's cute. Okay, you're doing this. Ace, what are you doing? Oh, he's just watching some TV. Let's go ahead and put some of this stuff away. Ace, you want to clean up a little bit? Uh, clean up all the food and stuff that needs to be cleaned up. I think what I'm also going to do is send Denver to daycare as well. So then that way, when, you know, when everybody is out, we can worry about that. You know, everybody will leave the house, basically. So I'm going to enroll him in daycare and we should be good. Actually, I don't know if I can enroll him in daycare. Maybe Journey has to do it. Enroll in preschool. I always say daycare, but it's preschool. Yes, she finished her homework for the day, which is great. And she is off to bed, which is good because she has a school day tomorrow. And this baby wants some more sugar, but no, we're not doing that. Let me go ahead and get him a little bit of a bed. I don't even think I should sell this because I was going to say, well, we're done having kids, but we're not. But there's another baby coming. Okay, this is cute. Okay, when you're done, you can go to sleep as well. And I think we'll be in good shape. I'm going to have him come up here and take him a quick shower. Journey, you should be good to go to sleep as well. And I think we can call this a successful episode. Did it go how I wanted it to? Absolutely not absolutely not. <laughs> but what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue to work on aspen's mental so she can harvest things from the garden and eventually start up her little her lemonade stand with her friends i think that'll be cute oh yeah i completely forgot about this because i was not paying attention to it but yeah it'll be all right okay oh look at her looking at the baby bump jesus what that baby do to this potty chair okay you know what go ahead and um, emergency repair Hey, y'all, <clears throat> editing D. I ain't gonna hold y'all. That baby, the announcement, the pregnancy, all of that, girl, it threw me for a loop. I was sitting here the whole time recording like, I cannot believe this child is pregnant. I don't know. how many. You could count how many times I didn't say it in the video, but girl, mm. anyway, I'm sorry you're so short, but y'all, it completely caught me off guard. I couldn't even function after this. I'm still shook. I'm editing and I'm like, I cannot believe this girl is pregnant. Okay, back to the video. Let's pretend. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is cute, though. And she needs to polish this and go to bed. Goodness. But, y'all, this is the house. This is the family. This is how it happens. I hope y'all enjoyed this episode. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. I will see you guys in the next one. Remember to stay beautiful, stay lovely, stay in the house, and have a grand, grand day. Bye, guys.